Hi everyone. A map of a neighborhood is drawn on a graph where units are measured in feet. We have to answer these four questions. So we have an angle here. Find the measure of angle 1. So this is angle 1 right here. It's kind of hard to see. So that's just the right angle there. So that's 90 degrees. And also the measure of angle 2. So basically this measure is 60 this is a right angle. I'll erase that in a minute. So if this is 60, this has to be 30 degrees because they're complementary angles. So you, this would just be 30 here because of this right angle here. All right. Find the distance from point P to line A. So we're going to uh, make it perpendicular. So you draw it straight there. That's a right angle. So uh, we can just subtract our x's here. So we're starting at 600 minus 100. So that's going to be 500 feet. And on the last question, we're going to have to look at that a little closer. So for the last question, we have to find the uh, distance from point P here to line C. And you're not going to pick anywhere on line C. You want the perpendicular uh, part. So the first thing we're going to do is find the uh, the uh, slope of line C. So that's this line right here. This line in here. So I pick here and here, two corners of the square. And I'm going up to to the right one. So the slope of line C is 2 over 1. So we want our perpendicular line to be the negative reciprocal of that. So that's negative uh, 1 half. So let's uh, erase this now. So from my point P, I'm going up 1 over 2. So this is the point you're going to choose um, to find the distance between these two points right there. So let's write that out. Uh, let's point P is 600 is my X. My Y is 300. And I'll call this um, point Q. Let's just call this point Q. So Q is 400 is your X. And your Y is right here. It's also 400. Now you can use your distance formula, which is square root of X sub 2 minus X sub 1 plus Y sub 2 minus Y sub 1. So let's call this uh, point 1 and point 2. No, I'm going to switch them. I want my bigger number to be 0.2. So call this 0.2, call this 0.1. Therefore, that means this is going to be x sub, uh, oh, I messed up again, x sub 2, x sub 1, y sub 1. Oh my gosh. All right. So let me fix this up. 400. So since this is a 2, that's going to be x sub 2, y sub 2. And since this is a 1, that's going to be uh, x sub 1, y sub 1. And I wish I had changed them, but I didn't. So we're going to have negatives in here. So we're going to do 400 minus 600 squared plus 400 minus 300 squared. Just extend that. Make sure you extend your square root. So this is going to equal the square root of negative 200 squared plus 100 squared. And when you put that in the calculator, you're going to get um, 224 feet. Make sure you always put this in negative in the calculator because this is really for um, 40,000. It's not negative 40,000, and this is really uh, 10,000. 
So that's what it would be. It would be the square root of 50,000, which gives you that. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Yeah. Weezy, I, Weezy.